how far are you going to try to you hit your required motion shot? Uh, my required motion shot is probably going to be uh, 50 yards here. About 50 yards. So it's right forearm parallel to the ground, both arms straight. Yeah, I work out a lot and uh, try to stay in decent shape. So I can run businesses, but I'd like to have a little pleasure. So in John's case, I like standing here behind him because we've, John's had plane issues uh, over the last few months, maybe really the last few years, and uh, just getting to where it's really getting on there very nice, and uh, it all starts right here. Even Wednesday, we started out, and these were getting a little bit steep. Like that one. Like that one. And... Uh, and so he needs to do a little better job just kind of monitoring the takeaway, tracing his plane line a little bit better. And sometimes we find because we're not using a, uh, a pivot on this motion that uh, the club has a tendency to go a little steep in the start up. So that might be something you can kind of monitor. How's the fan feel this morning? You know, it feels, it just feels like nature now. Yeah. You know, probably have to end this tape, will you? Huh? You know, probably have to end this tape. What? Neither one of us talk very loud. <laughs> John, if you require both of your normal, your normal hinges as far as auto, I'm just going to try to hit several, all three hinges here just to get a sense. Well, what I do is I'll go through and I'll, I'll, I will hit them just to wake them up. Okay. Uh, it's like I told you yesterday, once I get through with my basic motion and acquired motion, I feel like I'm ready to go play. It's just a matter of me going through the rest of the bag, just getting a little feel, but um, it's amazing how you can hit. 50 shots with basic motion, required motion, and it's like you're ready to go play now. You feel like you got all your alignments set where they need to be. Kind of hit it the same distance, but vertical, that's not going to happen. Uh, really, 
only time I use vertical hinges pretty much around the green. Say that like if, if this was truly your uh, practice routine to, to warm up, and, uh, you might just use a couple different hitches in, in the basic motion and not worry about it as much as required. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I actually I will hit uh, you know several I'll hit a few shots. You know if I've got uh, you know, trying to hit a 75 yard shot or something, I want to apply some angle hitting. I'll hit a few of those to I mean, four or fives or if you have to chip out. You know, just you, know, you never know when you play golf. So. Now what I'll do is I'll probably hit a couple just total motion and then after I do that then I'm going to go ahead and probably go to my to my eight iron and, and basically start getting some feel and rhythm. Right, that's total motion. Yeah. Okay. Do a couple of these. I'm going to move the camera around so we can uh, watch it do some chip motions. Basic motions from the uh, front on. So these are just some basic motions from the front front view. So what do you feel like you're going to monitor from this this side here? You know, just your flat left wrist, bent right wrist, flying wedges. Yeah. Okay. You don't spend a whole lot of time on this because it's already pretty ingrained in there. I don't spend. I spend more time than probably somebody that's actually trying to work on it. Yeah. Though. Yeah. But. But it's not like you have to be very conscious of maintaining a flat left bent right. No, I'm not. I'm not pretty worried good. if I've got a flat left wrist because I know I have it there. Right. I mean, I'm going to hit a few shots every now and then where I'm going to yeah. flip it or throw it away just like anybody else. But. Uh, yeah. You know, the reason I hit so many shots of basic motion, like I stated before, is, you know, I'm trying to be precise on what I'm trying to do, and I can work on everything just out of basic motion. And, right. You know, and I don't, I'm not getting any younger, so I don't wear myself out either. Go ahead and do a few acquired. Total. To both arms straight? Yeah. So interesting thing here, hit them a little too far, how about we just go a little lighter lag pressure? Okay. Total motion, a little lighter lag pressure. Sorry, acquired motion. Be good. 